Prophet وسلم, informed us in a hadith, he said, amal Allah, wa in qal. The most beloved deeds in the sight of Allah is that which is most consistent, even if it is a small amount. This hadith is a very powerful hadith to help us be firm and strong and be upright. And that's in this and being upright and being consistent in doing good deed is so important that a companion came to the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and he said to him, He said, O Messenger of Allah, tell me something in Islam that no one else can advise me about. Meaning, tell me something important that only you would be able to give. So this is a very important advice, and it's an advice that if put to practice, will benefit us in this life and the hereafter. And you know, the Prophet ﷺ was given what was called Jawami' al-Kalim. Jawami' al-Kalim meaning he was given the, the eloquence of precise and concise speech, meaning concise and precise, but with vast meaning and vast benefits. Few words, yet these words are words that should be written with gold because they are so beneficial if you were to reflect upon them. And so the Prophet وسلم, said to this companion, he said, Qul amantu billah, thumma istaqib. Say, I believe in Allah and then have al-istiqamah. Al-istiqamah is being upright and consistently upright. But we know that our iman goes up and down. And the Prophet Sallallahu mentioned it also. He said, Inna li kulli amalin shirra. Indeed, every deed that we do has its high points. And there are times in which we're motivated. Like you have a lot of energy, full of energy to do some of these deeds. Wa inna li kulli shirratin fatra. But every single point of motivation that you have, that zeal that you may have also has a down point, a low point, where it actually, it doesn't stay, that mo your motivation doesn't stay that way, and it goes back down. And he said, whosoever, whosoever's low point, still within my sunnah, meaning you don't crash, you go down, but there's a limit. And if you don't crash, and, and, every, and a low point, fatrah means just a low point, you know, like a, a downtime. And whosoever's downtime and low point is still within the sunnah, then he will be successful. Then he will be successful. And so that's why it's very important for us to be consistent in our deeds. But how can we be consistent? Consistency is the key, even if it's a small amount. If we're consistent with our deeds, and how can we be consistent with our deeds? You have, we have to understand that when we make a commitment, do not commit yourself to something you're not going to be able to be consistent with. Try to set a minimum requirement that you will do for the rest of your life, that you can do every day, even on the busiest day in your life. Consistency in recitation of the Qur'an, in giving sadaqah, Consistency in visiting the sick, consistency in fasting, in charity, and in everything that we do. Well, the, the key is what the Prophet ﷺ said. The most beloved deeds in the sight of Allah are that which is most consistent, even if it is just a small amount. Assalamualaikum. Islamic Motivation, Din John and Din John Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamualaikum. Islamic Motivation, Din John and Din John Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamualaikum. Islamic Motivation, Din John and Din John Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box and pin command to buy some Islamic products. Thank you. Assalamualaikum. Islamic Motivation, Din John and Din John Bangla is our official channel. Visit our description box 
एंड पिन कमांड टू बाई सम इस्लामिक प्रोडक्ट्स थैंक यू